we knew uh, coming into the year what type of he's a, he's a great kid, uh, very very smart football player. Played slot for us last year, and we kind of knew we'd have to lean on him. And I, I say this all the time: he'd be the first one to tell you and give the credit to the offensive line, the things they do, uh, where we are seeing you led. But I can't say enough about him. If you get him in the second, and third level. He can make you miss. Uh, he's really starting to understand how to run the football inside the tackles. He some really good tough runs inside. He, he's just he's just as good of a kid as he is. A per I'm so proud of him, uh, and, and and we coach him hard, and he deserves a night like tonight. I'm proud of him. Does a, a game like this show that he deserves to play on the next? I know that's a year off, but like, and he's a next level back. Yeah, maybe so. He's a junior. Uh, the yards say so, you know, and, and he, he brings some things on third down, and he can catch the ball at the backfield. Uh, He's not a big kid, but he understands protection, so he's good on third down. So he, he might have a chance to be an every down back at the next level. But he's very, very smart. Uh, he understands the scheme. He's not out there just playing backyard football. And, uh, that's what I like most about him. So, uh, again, I, I'm so proud of him. Yeah, uh, in spring football. Uh, against our defense, who I think is pretty good. Uh, you know, we line up and play against those guys every day. And I think that defensive front, you had number five who's out right now to that defensive front. Uh, there were some good battles in spring and fall camp. So we thought we were pretty good on the O-line and D-line going into this thing. And, and to see him pop some runs and some tough runs in camp in spring, I think that's when we kind of knew, hey, we got something here. And we lost one. A lot of people said, you know, you lost a back. What you going to do now? And I kind of knew what we had. And, uh, you know, he's not getting a chance to show it now. Even with Martrell on crutches, to contain Harlem the way y'all did early, I mean, make it tough for him to get what he ended up getting, how big was that just to let y'all get out to that? Yeah, uh, look, he's really good. And, and when the quarterback went down, I, was, yeah. I said, it might be worse because now he's going to touch it. He's in the Wildcat and he's going to touch it every play, right? And uh, I can't say enough about our defensive staff one, uh, Chris Lashley and, and and those guys, just a good plan. That's two years in a row against these guys. I thought that we were well prepared. And then that, that's all good on the chalkboard, right? But then our players come out here and, and execute it. And uh, he's going to get his runs, which we knew. Uh, but we knew that seven or 14 points wasn't going to win this game. We knew we could you know, move the ball and put some points on the board. You going to talk to your guys?